Hey, Jules, if you want to see how I achieve this beautiful magenta slash red violet color, just stay tuned for the details. And as you can see, this hair is beautiful. It is by Diamond Dynasty. I have four bundles and a closure. My closure is 20 inches. My bundles start at 22, 24, 26, and 28. And I use every single bundle for this wig. Yes, it is a wig. And as you can see, it is so beautiful. So just stay tuned for the color coming up. What you see me doing here is just applying the hair color into the bowl. This is the um, the red violet in the smaller bowl. And then in the bigger bowl, I'm going to do the magenta color. So I separate them in two different bowls. And then I just go ahead and with my 40 volume developer, which I tend to use because I want my hair to be as bright as possible. Um, and I want the color to take as well. So I go with my 40 volume developer and mix that with the color in two separate bowls. This is me applying the magenta um, into my mixing bowl while I already have my developer waiting. Again, it is 40 volume developer. That's all I use whenever I'm doing a bright color unless I already have previously lightened hair. Um, and now with this magenta, because I have it in a bigger bowl, it's because I wanted more of a magenta color. Now, if you want more of the red violet color and just a little of the magenta, you would do it in the opposite bowls. Like So here you see me applying the red violet to a small strip of the hair. This is because, like I said before, I'm doing highlights. So I'm just applying it to this one strip of the hair. And then you're going to see me doing bigger portions with the magenta color. As you can see, I'm just going to do this method throughout all four of my bundles as well as with my closure because I just want the highlights throughout the hair. And I'll make sure at the very end of the video that I make sure I put a video so that you can actually see how the highlights turned out throughout the hair. So stay tuned to the very end.
And what you can see me doing here is just applying that burgundy color, the red violet, to the roots of the hair. And then I'm going to go in with the red on the ends. I still applied it as highlights like I did with the bundles. Um, I just did it a little differently. Um, I just wanted the roots to be dark. I didn't want it to be bright red like the rest of the hair. So that's why I did the red violet to the roots. And then I also did the highlights in the hair with the red violet. And then put the rest of the magenta throughout the hair. Visuals. that's about it i just made sure to make this video short and sweet for you guys and as you can see jewels after i finish down the hair i just go ahead and clean up my workstation and i fold all of the hair up into full i usually leave it on for about and maybe up to an hour sometimes an hour and 15 then i wash it out in cold water and condition it i do not shampoo it just condition it once you finish doing that and you leave the hair um, just sitting wrapped up and then you wash it out. This should be the color that the hair comes out to Again, this hair is by Diamond Dynasty Y'all, they don't even sponsor me to put out the hair. Let me just say that first of all They don't pay me anything. They don't sponsor me Y'all know in every video, every hair video that I have done before This is the hair that I use. I just love it so, so much like it is amazing again this was four bundles and a closure and i just thank you guys so much for watching my videos and tuning in and i will see you jewels next video